Good morning from Arizona. Uh, it's a beautiful day here today. This morning it's about 80 degrees. And I'm loving this weather, but it is starting to get hot, so we are having some aquaponic concerns. Everything actually is doing really well, surprising um, from the heat, because it has been like 100 degrees the last few days, and we're hoping everything survives. Um, my husband put up some burlap up here to give the plants a little bit of shade. Um, but the tomatoes are looking good. We've got some ripening on the vine and they're delicious, so that's exciting. And we put the last of our seedlings in the bed. Um, the pepper that we put in are not too happy and I don't know if it's a heat issue or what. Um, but you can kind of see they're a little wilted. However, we put basil in and the basil's perked up really nicely. Um, Actually, all this was started from seed. We started it inside, and then I slowly exposed it to the sun and then put it in the beds. Um, a couple of things, though, as an experiment, my husband actually put a seed directly in the bed, and that's these little guys. And it grew fine, too, but it grows a lot slower, we noticed. And then we propagated some other plants by taking a clipping off this ch cherry tomato. We, he took just an arm off the cherry tomato and stuck it right in the... the uh, bed and it is producing fruit so that's another way you can do it too which is really cool but yes so it's been like 100 degrees um, we're nervous about the fish so my husband's been putting ice blocks in the pond to keep the water temperature down because obviously the eyes will bug out of their head and they'll die if they get too hot we've got koi and goldfish in there and they're pretty temperature sensitive um, we've heard that if your fish die you can pee in the pond to keep the system going but we're hoping it doesn't uh, result to that um, new stuff. I'm trying to think if there's anything new. Everything's doing really well. We've got a little heat damage, you can see on those leaves. So hopefully the shade will help. Uh, we're wondering if the tomato plants will still keep producing fruit now that it's getting warm. Usually they don't set fruit after a certain temperature. But, in the last couple days, this little guy over here has started to set fruit. So, they're continuing to do their thing, which is really exciting. Um, even though it's getting hot. So we'll see what happens. Um, that's about all that's new, and we'll keep you posted. Have a great day.